Yes, people, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are all doing well. So you've probably seen by now that this week I got to go to Carrington, the Aeon Training Complex with Stretford Paddock to go and interview Diogo Delo. It was part of the fans forum and Manchester United invited us down. Yes, they're being a little bit more hospitable to myself and Stretford Paddock these days. And we got to go down there and see Diogo Delo take part in a fans Q&A in a press conference style uh, format. And then after that, Myself, Stretford Paddock and a few other fan channels got an exclusive one-on-one -on -one interview time with Diogo Delo, about four or five minutes to ask questions that we had. So we went down there and while I was there, I thought, I know, the people of my channel would love to see what's going on at Carrington. So I took a camera, managed to grab a few little things and uh, yeah, check it out. It's not that long, but hopefully you enjoy it. Yes, people, so as you can see, I'm at Carrington today. I've been invited down here for a fan Q&A uh, type thing with Diogo Delo. I've also been told I've got some one-on-one -on -one time with him as well. Um, so while I'm here, I'll show you as much as I can of Carrington. Um, you've just seen us drive in there. And of course, uh, the interview with Diogo Delo, which is for Stretford Paddock. So keep it live. Let's go. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, great. Two chair away. He's coming back in the day and pulling them Okay, Adam, you're all that's standing between Diogo and a, a Ten Hag team meeting. So, uh, we have? No, uh, one o'clock. You got, you, got, you got time. Yes, guys, we're here with Diogo Delo. Diogo, great to see you again. Saw you in the summer. Uh, we saw uh, the other week uh, Rashford got into a little bit of trouble for turning up late. What have you done to make sure you're not waking up late? You got extra alarms on, making sure you're not getting trapped? <laughs> I mean, it's discipline. Uh, obviously, this, 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 this just puts standards on... on on the camp, on the on, on training ground, on, on when we are in the hotels. Uh, you, and it all started in the pre-season. Uh, it was very, very, very strict with, with rules, with, with, uh, with the mandings uh, inside and outside the pitch. Uh, and for me, uh, to be honest, it's been, it's been normal because I already put these this standards on, on myself. Uh, I don't like... I don't like to 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 break uh, rules, so so I know that that um, I have to be very disciplined. If you had to pick a five-a-side team out of the players that are playing currently for United, who would you pick? <laughs> uh, including myself or not? You can include yourself. I like that. Um, so I would say me, uh, Licha, Bruno, uh, Rashi and Casemiro. Nice, no goalkeeper, I love that, all out attack. Yeah, right <laughs> Diogo, thank you very much for that, good luck for the rest of the season as well and uh, hopefully picking up a trophy or two. So thank you for watching the video guys, hope you enjoyed the little vlog there and I gave you a little bit of an insight into my day um, at Carrington. Make sure you're keeping it locked to this channel by hitting that subscribe button, liking, commenting, sharing as well and we'll be back with plenty more content. I'll see you in a bit.